So still having a global to mindset conversation, Africa for Smart Kids with Coach Louis. Mm-hmm. And the question now is, um, how much have you grown in the global to space? Wow, uh, enormously, enormously. Uh, firstly, what makes you think that you've grown? <laughs> I think the the person in me, you know, the way I talk lately, the way I present myself, my humility when I'm around other people, because as a leader, I think you must you must be able to follow at some time so that you can be able to lead the way. It's not always the the same thing that we we are used to back then of a teacher standing up in front and everybody listening to the teacher and then they can't even hold in their own ideas or experience. So in Plobut, what we do, everyone is equal. We just facilitate the whole learning area and then the kids have their ideas and suggestions and then it takes out the genius in them. That is how I'm learning and growing in Plobut. If you were to recommend the Africa for Smart Kids program Mm -hmm. and the Globuntu Mindset, to anyone around you, what will you say it is in a few words? In a few words, I'd... Actually, I'd write a book trying to explain, but in a few words, I'd just say, parent or teacher or malume or uncle, this is what you've been looking for your child. If you want your child to be uh, prosperous, successful, and, 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 and confident in themselves, so Ubuntu is the actual right space because in Ubuntu, we grow your confidence, we grow everything that you need, we give you all the necessary equipment and tools for the child to be actually who they want to be. So Ubuntu is there to enhance and, and monitor everything from the growing of the child to what they call working for themselves. Yeah. Good. Um, you have been reading a couple of Africa for Smart Kids books. Oh yes, oh yes. Will you say you have learned anything about Africa from those books that you had not known before? Yeah, exactly. I mean, these books are amazing. Actually, they're phenomenal. Thank you to Ms. Bia Chaleke for these books. Firstly, you know, they teach you about what Africa is from A to Z. Uh, Our flags, the color of our flags, the currencies, the food we eat, the beautiful places you can visit in Africa, as opposed to people think that we live in cages like monkeys and we live with elephants and lions in our homes. That's not true. Africa is actually a beautiful and learned country. Africa is a beautiful and learned country because I'm calling it a country because we are one. I don't want to call it a continent. To me, a country is Africa and not South Africa. Yeah. So go into books. I think it's it's those are uh, a, a very a very a very uh, beautiful and and you know uh, what is the word uh, good books for a kid to, to to read. I think they are very much phenomenal in their lives. Yeah. So, Coach Louis, where do you see yourself in mm-hmm. the next six months? The next six months? Oh, that's a lot of time and I, I would have done so much work. The next six months, I want to see uh, Coach Louis' class that has graduated in December, having their own uh, groups of, of, of maybe children or of, of their peers. We have directors, we have actors, we have designers, we have public speakers, we have readers, we have, the, the list is endless. So I want to see those people pushing their, their, their talents, uh, taking the skill that they learned from Coach Louis and Lobundu, giving it out there so that it's generational and this thing is ongoing. That's the whole purpose. Um, we are into the month of the African child. Aha. 16 <laughs> June is the day set aside by the by the African Union to commemorate the African child, specifically mm-hmm. coming from the youth uprising mm-hmm. in Sha- uh, in Soweto in 1960, 1976. 1976 and yes. you are from Soweto. Oh, yes. What does June 16 represent to you? <sighs> now, June 16, 1976, I think it happened because Brave students stood up. Brave students who knew what they wanted out of life stood up. They made one thing called the Mbomba unity. They told themselves that if they do not stand up, nobody will. 
So they stood up against the Af Africans' language that was uh, being forced on them and imposed through the uh, the ruthless imposition by by the you know what the apartheid regime. So that was a, a, a very a proud thing for me. That was a very courageous thing to do for the students to stand up for their rights so that the next generation may have the fruits and still live with the fruits. I mean, the next generation was what? The fees must fall generation. They also stood up so that we can have a free education in South Africa. So where they left off, the Ubuntu is taking from that. Now we are having our own revolution for the next generation. This is the next generation of the future. The books are the future. I know my Africa, I love my Africa. An African child ought to know where they come from. Not hear what they were told before, but how they know themselves and their Africa. Identity is important. We live in a very broad world and a broad society where everyone is like, keep, keep, I'm a keep, keep, that's what we call it. And, and so to start, coming from the hood, I mean, we used to be um, mixed, mixed families. We live in with aunts, grandmas, malumes, but then we are all becoming one in Bumba. Why can't we do that in our society in South Africa? So thanks to the student of 1976 for them standing up. Not forgetting the massacre that happened in 1960. We also say salute to them. Thanks to the fees must fall. I was there. Yes, I was there. I was in school as a student. I fought hard. I'm still here with Globuntu and still the struggle continues. Aluta continua. With books, we rise. Without books, we die. Yep. Those were powerful words, Coach Lee. Thank, Thank you, you so very much. much. <laughs> um, so we're closing the session, but um, you will still hear much, much, much more from Coach Lee and above all, you will meet him in this class with his smart kids and you will see what he's capable of. So watch out for that channel. Subscribe if you want to see more of Coach Lee. Yeah. And um, there is much more in the making. So you're in the global into space and... Uh, what do we say? It always seems impossible until it is done. And Coach Louis salutes you. It is done. Consider it is done. <laughs>